Howdy folks, Elgrax here. Um, so we have a small problem. Now we're back playing Borders Gate 3. And, um, well, wouldn't you know it, I've sort of... Well, I've died a bit. I'm sure it's just temporary. But, yeah, I'm, I'm dead over here. So we need to figure out a way of shutting that down somehow. I'm assuming just create water isn't going to help anything. Uh, that's correct. I was hoping the braziers might do it. Because these things are just non-stop. lag and I haven't saved this morning. No. <laughs> okay. Uh bear with me. That's my first crash. And I don't think I've saved once. So I don't know where we are. Um so, uh, hold tight. I'm going to look back in. Uh, hey, let's try using DirectX 11. Why didn't I save once I got inside? Why didn't I save before I attempted to go and get that book? All excellent questions, and I'm glad you asked. So, um, unless I'm mistaken, we're going all the way back to the beginning here, which is crazy. Druid Grove. Uh, I'm good to load. Whew. Okay. Let's go. Uh, allow access. Obviously. It's like, hey, we're allowed to, to run? Yeah, of course. I've been playing this game for, I think I'm at 25 hours already. Okay, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Um, and it's weird, because, like, I know this is a risk. Rats. Okay, so we're going to speed through. How frustrating. Well, at least we know where we're going, what we're doing. Um, if we get lucky, we might actually we might try some different options on the uh, the mirror. See if we can get through next time. Oh boy, though, what a mm. how frustrating. All right, so we actually went that way, I think, if I remember correctly. No, we're in this way. And what we're gonna do is we're just gonna. There was a time I tussled with hill giants without breaking a sweat. It's just uh... now a mere werebear could swap me halfway to arm. Strange things are happening to us. Or festers in our minds may well impel our bodies. There we go. Let's, uh, guidance here, please. That's right. Uh, you know, while we're thinking of it, Gail, do me a mage armor, please. You give yourself some false life. Cool. Thanks. And up you go. Hmm. 
Hmm. Not sure we're going to get there in time for this guidance. Oh, how annoying is that? Oh, we didn't pick that up last time. Oh, well that's convenient. Hmm. Okay, I'm not going to worry too much about the uh, egg sack here, I don't think. I'm, I'm too busy being annoyed that we lost all that time. So. Um. Just run over here quickly. Eliminate some of the uh, fog of war. Have you wondered what people will say when? When they find out the monster hunter is becoming a monster. I've faced countless perils and conquered them all. This will be no different. I've always had a soft spot for the confident ones. Let's go they look at this boar. It looks healthy. A dead boar. But it doesn't look like it's been touched by scavengers. Um, medicine. <clears throat> we failed last time. We failed this time. Consistent. The boar seems to be fresh, only a few hours dead. But you can't find any sign of a wound. Right. I think, if I recall correctly, we neglected to check that chest there. Let's do that real quick. Interesting. Uh, pretty sure that was not what was in there last time. It's actually more. Which means that this might have something good in it. Because what was it? Eight gold last time? Was our secret stash? Eight gold? What on earth? Slightly better. Actually, it might not be. Because gold is exactly gold value. Alright, let's go talk to the hag real quick. Um. Lads, for the love of all that is holy, I've never clapped eyes on your poor sister. Go. Go guidance him. Maya, fuck your Stop this. We we won't. Mm, Insight failed again. again. Uh how about we uh, just calm down Careful. what's going on here? Don't trust the word out of her mouth. Our sister went to the hag and we ain't seen her since. <clears throat> Hand over heart, I don't know their sister. I will gladly help you all look for her, though. Enough. Where is she? Ethel, <sighs> what did you do to their sister? Alex. Yeah, we'll disapprove again. You were supposed to rush to my defense, love. That lot of mm. good you are. I met a game that Some a bit. Advice? I've had dealings with hags. You ever darken my door, you'd best have that head bowed <clears> and <throat> an apology at the ready. Bye bye now. Then poof. Bloody hells. She just disappeared. I ain't seen nothing like that before. She could shoot fireworks out of her backside for all I care. The hug has bring her. Uh, will someone tell me what's going on? It's our sister, Mary. Okay, there we go. She's 
well, got that side quest active again. She was in a bad way after her husband died. Started saying weird things, like how she was gonna bring him back. Next thing, she's gone looking for the hag. Of all the stupid things to do. Yeah, who'd go looking for a sense. hag in that situation? And no good ever came from dealing with a hag. None of this matters, all right? We need to get her back and fast. Um, let me. I'll bring Marina talking? home. I ain't got a clue who you are. No way, I'm leaving Rena to you. I like that because normally in D and D, you, you volunteer. On our own. Now, come on. And then someone says, "Oh, thank you." Here, they're like, "No." All right. Uh, back to the cellar. Watch your goblins. Just clear the fog of war. You seem to know a good deal about our condition, Gay. Everything, really. And let's go back to the cellar. Alright, so we whipped through that bit pretty quick. Well, I think we managed to do that without even... Uh... God, that's so clever. And annoying. That they put it there like that. Right. Save. Let's go. Yeah, this area really has some issues. Wish there was a way through there. That would have been handy. Don't think there is. Okay. And in the interest of speeding things up. Aha. We're on to you, pal. <laughs> I love making things fall over. I'm not saying it's damaging, but it's entertaining. Um, you don't need to make it good. Go on, fall over again. I don't know. Oh, he saved. I'm actually quite happy for you to kind of get in there a bit. Uh, hey, let's let's get a hex going, shall we? Oh, we need to change weapons again. Uh, let's do that now, because we've decided that that thing is more harm than good. I like that this just gives you guidance as a cantrip. Like, just permanently. That's kind of neat. Um, yep, okay, you're fine. Uh, would you be so kind as to fly here? And then stabby step. Okay, useless. Would you be so kind as to fly here? And then stabby step. And then would you be so kind as to wander in, get yourself a hex going. Alright, he's not in a good way. Yeah, go hit it. Or don't. Hit it. Or don't. Hit it. Or don't. Big eggs. I'm not sure why we're getting such terrible values to hit here. Targets obscured in shadows. Uh, no, left. Um.
Well, can you reach that? No, you've done your movement. Aha! How shadowy are you now? Everyone done stuff? Yeah. I did one damage. Ten percent. Ridiculous. This is the most dismal fight ever. Just need one thing to hit. Just one. Everybody gone? Yep. Cool. Five percent chance of hitting. What on earth? There we go. No. Well, you don't look that up. Alright, we know there's going to be more. This guy was one. It's interesting. It said we were surprised, but then nothing happened. Weird. Read. Okay, so we know we're it's on the top that we're dealing with. Why don't we just get experience there? Don't know. Grab the little bullywog trumpet. Uh, let's open this one. Pretty sure that had someone in it last time too. So weirdly, we, I think we're getting less loot as a result of having accidentally already done some of this. But that's fine. Let's light this incredibly dangerous candle. Boy oh boy, would we really like to not get purged this time. <clears throat> okay, you know what, to that point. Separate off. Shadow heart. Come over here with everyone else. Uh, inventory. Uh, and rather equipment. We're going to switch to this. Tori. So, you're now going to <sighs> ridiculous. Cast guidance on yourself. Just drank poison. <laughs> okay. Now we're going to go look at the mirror. Speak your name. I'm going to examine to try and understand it. That is nice and low.
The magic is old and wavering, but you recognize it. The mirror is a thinking rock, hiding some secret. The face is crafted to be pleasing, but the personality is just a reflection of the wizard that created it. Speak your name. I'm going to try telling it my name this time. I do not know this name. If you are known to my master, step forward okay. and declare yourself an ally. Uh, yes, I'm an ally. A true ally of Illentoth may pass. Right. What think you? Of the Zolkir known as Zastan. It's garbage. I hate him. Richard creature. You are no Zolkir. But are you wise? Yes. Tell me, why might one use balsam ointment? Um, clean your wound. Acceptable. Finally. If you could see anything in me, what would it be? Okay. Ones I love was not right. So it's two or three. Let's go for three. Pathetic. A poor choice. You will be purged. Rats. Now, question. Okay, uh. Okay, it's coming now. I wonder what happens. We dash. And then just sprint through now. Some nice sparkles going on there. I'm not sure what's causing that. Guidance or something else. Okay, MP. Would you be so kind? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so it didn't see me. Now this hasn't been activated. Also, last time it got knocked down there, this hasn't been activated at all. I wonder if we... Maybe that won't activate. Come up here. No, no. I'm sure you're perfectly delightful. I can't talk right now. No, you can't. I wonder what's over there. Doesn't look like anything. Also, if we just hit the map here for a second. Powerful tome. Okay, just looking to see what's what, really. So that's the, the ladder up. Gotcha. Is doing its little flambe thing. This still hasn't started up. OK. 
Okay, okay. Oh. We're going to try and mage hand that. That's what we're going to do. Okay. Um, so he's doing this flambe. You guys are just going to hang out over here for now. I don't think it came all the way up here last time. to be able to see where it's going. It's just blowing everything up. And doing a lot of damage while it does so. Okay. Please cast Mage Hand. Okay. Mage Hand. <laughs> oh, and you can move. Okay, good. The book is locked tight with no visible keyhole. Only an now it started up. recess in the cover's mouth. You try to examine the book, but the longer you stare, the more those piercing amethyst eyes draw you in. I'm going to tuck the book in my pack. Uh-oh. Okay. So it turns out it did go all the way up here. Let's just put everyone out. Get rid of that burning condition. So. Is it at this point just returning and that's it? It's done? It looks like that might be the case. It's gone in. I think it's done its job. So we nearly got them far enough back. Should have gone back to here, probably. Um, okay. So, inventory. Uh, Gale, eat one of those. And then... Uh, one of those. Good enough, you're fine. You eat one of those. Lovely. Well, you can eat one of these as well. Perfect. Okay. You're pretty good then. So now, let's do a little bit of create water here. And then you can lead them through. Uh, is there a way through there? There is. And here, as long as they're not stupid. And then, let's have another one of these, please. Uh, yeah, that looks good. Hopefully you guys can all get through without getting set on fire. Should be able to come in. Alrighty. Okay, that door's mysteriously locked itself. Apparently the candle received the condition burning. <laughs> um, quick save. Okay. We are mostly back where we were. Very good news. So let's uh, come up here and go through the quick looty loot. Yep, take that. feel awful because we're making it work so hard here. Uh, where's the bottle rack? Let's check the bottle rack, please. Don't think there was anything else down there of great importance. So let's come down. Come over here. Okay. Uh, not so interested in the small bottles. Let's just read this. This is reanimating dead flesh. We knew that was coming. Moonhaven logbook. Okay. Uh, oh. Unlock the ancient tome. So we have to decide what we do. We can destroy it. Or we can unlock it. 
So we have options. Cool. Oh, wait. Oh, and save uh, Marina. Yep. Nothing on the bottle rack. Uh, we'll take the scroll of Featherfall and the Basilisk Oil and that cool funnel thing. Do we check that bottle rack? Never mind. Nothing in there. Alrighty. Continuing on, uh, check the Skelly Skell. Check the research notes, which just said what everything that was going wrong. Uh, hey, magnifying glass. Wooden bowl. Now, who knows if we'll get the same drops here. Let's find out. Go to chest. Scroll of science and protection of good and evil. We didn't have that. Evil eye. I don't think we looked at that last time. Hags. Interesting. Okay. It seems rather fitting, doesn't it? Since we were just dealing with one. I don't know about you, but I'd kind of like to get away from that thing. Grab ourselves a painting. I don't think we need a coal bucket. We'll take the antitoxin. Don't need another skull. We've got plenty of them. Take that painting. Nothing in the bottle rack. Okay, and here. Empty bars. Funnel. Uh, oh yeah, incense. Uh, I feel like incense has value, if I recall. Crystal ball does not, so I'm not going to bother. Oh. Check that chest. A couple more spells. Uh, if I recall, there was um, yeah, mugwort. Alrighty, Roo. Uh, I believe we've pretty much covered this area. So, one more quick save. And then we're into a room that clearly has a way out. I've accidentally done that. All right. And we are going to put in another break here. And we have, thankfully, uh, undone all of the damage that was done earlier. I'm going to take a brief uh, interlude. When I return, we're going to find out what happens when I pull that lever. Hopefully, something good. Uh, yeah. Uh, YouTube, thanks for watching. I will see you next time. Um... Hey, let's uh, let's quickly get our friend back. Hey, buddy. You know what, Will? Why don't you also just uh, get yourself a new friend? Your old one was looking a bit hurt. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.